Hey bud, how's it going? If you're new to the channel, then welcome. Take a seat. And if you're coming back, Ashley, when they say home is where the heart is. They don't mean under the floorboards. Welcome back to another movie reaction. My name is Sam. Steph. And we're the movie buds. So the Princess Protection Program. Yeah, I didn't even really know about this until Danny made a video on it. Same. And I was like, huh. Ah. I did watch that video, but it was a while ago. And I literally remember nothing oh, of Danny the film. Danny Gonzalez, by the way. Yeah. I, I shouldn't just, it's weird. So we're in, I guess, Louisiana? Yeah, making that abundantly clear. Mm. Trying to, anyway. No, it's not like Louisiana is the only swamplands in America. But I mean, this could just be like from several different locations. <laughs> we wouldn't know. Yeah. We've never been. So this is how we know that she's a real girl. Yeah, she's relatable. She's a rough and tumble kind of gal. Yeah. Hey, you just... Hi, Donnie. Hey. <laughs> oh, she's just stunned by how generic he looks. Yeah. Carter. Right, how much? No charge. Dude. A deal's a deal. Wait, what's... For a bait in exchange for never having to take the bus again. Oh, uh, he gives her a ride. Okay. Oh. Uh, school, I'm guessing. Uh, I was going to say, don't just give away shit for free, but mm. if you got a deal... Yeah. Come in. Brooke's already wrinkling my after lunch outfit. You don't need a costume change, but you might want to think about it. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with her outfits. You guys are kind of all wearing. I'm sorry, Carter. Hey, thanks for the bait. Wait, is this dickhead seriously? Wait, what? Are you for real, they man? Just, they just left her? You, you made a deal. You literally had a deal. She said, what the fuck? What an asshole. Uncool. I can't stand them. They're such princesses. <laughs> Foreshadowing. Mm -hmm. Carter, they're teenage girls. They're probably just jealous. I'm pretty sure they're not. You don't know. Yeah, you'd be surprised. People like that a lot of times tend to be pretty insecure. It's Mason. Right away. We're leaving again? Two days max. This is the routine op. Yeah, that's what you always say. Routine op. Yeah. You love the military speak. Oh, just yeah. Just so you know. He goes on ops. Yeah. He doesn't have jobs. He's got ops. <laughs> <laughs> just be careful, okay? Always. Yeah, it's your average week. He stabilized a foreign government. <laughs> oh, fuck. Just a Tuesday. <laughs> you and me, pal. Oh, fucking got the... Oh, yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm glad she's tight with her dad. There's pretty much two types of dads in these Disney Channel type movies. Yeah. It's the afraid kind of angry dad, mm, who's mm. basically a good guy. But, yeah, you know, misguided. Yeah, he's a little misguided. And there's the guy who's just fucking sweetheart. Yeah. The perfect dad. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> a treasure yeah. to us all. Rosalinda Marie Montoya Fiore. And you're walking? Yeah, she sure is walking. Take it to the runway. Mm -hmm. Runway. Coronation is one month away. Why do we have to practice now? So that you're ready ahead of time? To get it perfect. What a beautiful coronation dress. I asked designer. You did, Mr. Elegante. Gay-coded characters called Mr. Elegante. Sure. My husband has passed away. Only she can become queen. And I'm afraid General Kane will take advantage. Hold on. Only she can become queen? Why can't you? She married in. Right. Turn to face your subjects. On our guest, family, friends. She only has those two subjects. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Those are the subjects. Princesa Rosalinda, if any person has a reason to object, let us know. Oh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a wedding. Pause. You're not really allowed to object unless the whole point is to just out the people who are like, all right, cool, we're executing you and you and you. <laughs> Even if you're going to object, what a way to do it. Yeah, then. Holy shit. He threw a sword through her crown, oh. directly above her head. The princess is too young to be queen. I mean, that's probably true. Costa Luna and Costa Estrella are tiny countries who must stand together against the world. Um, are you at war against the rest of the world? <laughs> I mean, not yet. I'm gonna be. Yeah. <laughs> Seize that. But see, he's establishing a republic. Uh -huh. He's toppling monarchies. He's, <laughs> he's, you know, uniting people. This guy, I like this guy. <laughs> <laughs> I like his moxie. Yeah, I like his moxie. I like the cut of his jib. <laughs> <laughs> He's making a lot of sense, bro. Go now with Major Mason. Go now! But yeah, so they are staging a coup. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I guess it makes sense. They're taking over. <laughs> this fuck? Actually, no, it's not a coup if they're from the neighboring nation. I guess it's just a hostile takeover. Yeah. An invasion? Yeah, I guess. You all right, Mama? Yeah, 
yes, yes. Oh. I knew General Kane would try something like this. Then why did you do it? <laughs> why did you say anything? <laughs> like, for the love of God. I get that you're keeping her safe and all that stuff. It's not nothing, but it seems like more could have been done. You know, prevent it entirely. But I must say, so the people know that you will return. No, not without safe. you. Yeah. So no matter what happens... But don't you know, in order for this story to work, you have to leave your mother behind? Yeah, for sure. This is a Disney movie. You're not allowed mothers. <laughs> You're a princess, remember? <laughs> you never forget you are a princess. We'll be together very soon. In the afterlife? <laughs> yeah, they're gonna kill them both. <laughs> oh god, especially after watching The Suicide Squad. Oh. This is... <laughs> we gotta go now. Wow, your forces are so tiny. Yeah. <laughs> what are there like 20 people in total on this whole fucking <laughs> island? <laughs> it's not implausible that this one guy is saving her because they only have 20 guys to be Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mom. I hope you don't get imprisoned. Yes. Wave to your mother, staring out at you forlongingly from the Airbnb <laughs> <laughs> that they hired for this movie. <laughs> never find her. As long as she remains free, there will be hope in Costa Luna. And then just comes up with a rocket launch. <laughs> she will contact her mother, and when she does, I will bring her back. You will never find her. She's right there, bro. <laughs> like... She will rot with her mother in a tiny dirt cell. You will never find her, but this heat-seeking missile... <laughs> yeah! <laughs> but it's RPG, well. <laughs> Take it away. I mean, again, he's toppling a monarchy. I can only hate this guy so much. As far as evil dictators go, he kind of just reminds me of Bison, though, from the first Street Fighter, Rahul Julia. Uh, I've not actually played them. No, 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 the movie. Yeah, not seen it. Okay, but you know who? You've seen the Adams Family. Gomez? Yes. No. Oh, okay. Well, he's the he's the dad. The... Yeah, Gomez. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. He plays M. Bison. Okay. The first Street Fighter? Uh, is that the dude in, in the red? Yes. Okay, right. Yeah, yeah. right. In Wreck It Ralph, he's in the. Yeah, top yeah. With yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any character like that is just like. Downgrade. It's not Bison, though. For sure. <laughs> like, it's, it's a terrible movie, but his performance in it is so good. Okay, fair enough. Yeah. yeah. What is this place? <laughs> what is this shithole? <laughs> Where have you taken me? <laughs> Actually, that looks pretty nice. Yeah. Oh, she had a Cinderella moment when she lost a shoe. Apparently. Nah, no, that's just the only way she's allowed in. You've got to accept this shoe. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, I fucking remember this bit from Danny's video now. Oh, okay. You are now in the safe custody of the PPP. I'm sorry, did you have to? Please don't abbreviate it like that. You'll be safe now. She just leaves her there. Yeah. What is stage one? Extraction. Stage two? Transition. Transition to what? Stage three. What? Hang on, so stage two is just getting to stage three? Yes. <laughs> Not really how stages work. Hello. Welcome to the operational heart of the program. Does it pick up in the microphones? Probably a little. I don't think it'll be bad. Yeah, it's storming over here. Yeah, guys, we, we had to pause because it's storming. We're just kind of checking out. It should be fine, though. Yeah, it should be fine. Well, if you hear stormy sounds, mm, that's why. Yeah. The top secret agency funded by the world's royal families. Fucking private billionaires. Yeah. Providing protection to 29 princesses who have been threatened. Yes, because no one likes you. <laughs> <laughs> so there's so many threats. This is Princess Sean. We rescued her from a politically motivated coup. We have placed her where no one will find her. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Is it worth saving her? She's freezing. But she's safe. I love the idea that there's so many coups against royal families all over the world that they need to make this fucking program. I think Danny said the same <laughs> yeah. thing. It's like, yeah. guys, take the hint. Yeah. <laughs> People don't like monarchies. Princess 299 is still rejecting all attempts at transformation. Mm -hmm. The fact that they have to protect that many princesses, they just said Princess 299, so there's at least 299. Call it an even 300. Mm -hmm. At least 300 princesses in need of protection all the time from coups. It's fucked, yo. It's insane. <laughs> she must go through stage three. You just see, I know she's a queen and then yeah. the second one, you see Anne Hathaway <laughs> somewhere back there. Yeah. That would be great. That would have been awesome. Transformation until you are unrecognizable. Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't be that hard to just put someone in regular clothes. I love how she made that seem so special. Yeah. No, stop. I do not know any of you people. So? I only trust Major Mason. What's that got to do with your haircut? Yeah, <laughs> I only trust Major Mason to make sure that I serve looks. <laughs> <laughs> Military man and renowned stylist. Mm. 
everything all right? Take me back to my country. <laughs> uh, kids. Buddy. <laughs> General Kane has taken control of your country and assumed command of its government. As soon as we find a legal way to remove him, you have to let us protect you. It's hysterical. Oh, we got to find a legal way. <laughs> totally. <laughs> oh. That's how we always do this oh. sort of thing, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Coastal Luna will become part of his own kingdom with its true royal family. Nothing but a memory. True royal family. You got to raise questions about the monarchy, but... <laughs> if you care about your country, nobody can know who you really are. It's fine. It's just a funny movie. That's propaganda for kids. That's all. <laughs> yeah. Nothing more to it. <laughs> you may proceed. Yeah. Proceed with Operation Make Her Look Like a Normal Girl. Because mm -hmm. there's such a vast difference right now. So even then, it's like normal girl by American standards. I, I know. <laughs> ah, yes, she looks so different. Whoa. Oh, transformation. Crazy. You are now Rosie Gonzalez, an average American girl. Yeah, she looks plain as shit. Stage four. Relocation. Somewhere where General Cade will never think of looking. Fucking Florida. Welcome to Louisiana, Rosie. I was right. Louisiana. Yeah. Fuck yeah. But it could have been Florida. They have swamps. Yeah, fair. I'm pretty sure. Potato, potato, really. Yeah. <laughs> I kid, of course. <laughs> nah. No one, no one fucking get in my grill about it. But you basically just signed on to be her adoptive father for this period of time. Essentially. Kinda. Oh, a fish! I've never seen one of those where I'm from. Welcome to your new home. For a while, at least. That's pretty nice. Yeah, it is. Lakeside property, easily a couple mil. <laughs> well, no, not that. But... <laughs> well, not that, Sean, sure, but here. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> here you go, sweetie. Looks like someone's back home again. Where yeah. do I know her from? Uh, I know her from My Name Is O. She plays Patty the daytime hooker. Right. She's been, a, she's been around. Was she in Breaking Bad? Yeah, she's I've been around. Yeah, she's been in a lot of stuff. Uh, Maria said the other day that she's a character actor and always pops up in like those kinds of roles. Mm. So. Dad? And you didn't tell your kid about the other girl that's going to be staying with her, didn't you? No. Hello. Hey. He do yeah, he could have messaged. <laughs> yeah. He could have at least called. A text. <laughs> yeah. Um, who are you? Rosa. Uh, Rosa. Rosie. Just Rosa would have been fine. Because you don't seem sure. Rosie. Could have just said Rosa, dude. Yeah. There's lots of Rosas in the world. It's fine. Major Mason gave me this room. Rosa. Rosa, 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 Rosa. Can't help it. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. Of course, the suite is much smaller than I'm used to. I feel much larger once I have that extra bed removed. Sorry. <laughs> I have that extra bed removed. It's mine. Will you excuse me? Yes, you are excused. Oh, boy, <laughs> dude. Uh, in all fairness, I know pretty much nothing about royals no. and how they are in real life. I don't fucking follow the British royal family. Yeah, I, I don't care. Yeah, I straight don't. up don't care about yeah. the British royal family or royal families at all. That's exactly why I know yeah. nothing about them. Well, exactly, <laughs> just for that. So I can't say whether or not that's accurate, just how out of touch she is. Mm -hmm. You met Rosie? Who is she and why is she in my room? I had to bring her here. The director didn't give me a choice. <laughs> I love his response here of like, yeah, I brought this random girl home, jumped her in my kid's room, didn't tell her about it, and she comes down here, rightfully so, yeah. like, hey, dad, what the fuck? And you're like, yeah, it's nothing. Yeah. Don't worry about it. it is, I'm just taking care of it. I'll get over it. Grow up. <laughs> <laughs> you have a sister now. You're like, things change. <laughs> um, but this isn't normal. Like, it's cool. Uh, Don't get me wrong. Yeah, it's no, great. Makes it's, sense. I'm Fine. happy that you're doing it, but fucking tell her. Yeah, for real. No need for this level of miscommunication. Yeah. A normal dad would go on a secret mission and bring his daughter back a t-shirt. Normal dad wouldn't be going anywhere on a secret mission, but I guess that's yeah. the joke. <laughs> I like to think... You know, again, it's a joke. Sure. <laughs> You'd like to hope so. You should have warned me. I didn't have a choice. What do you mean you didn't have a choice? The way he says it makes it sound like he's saying, I had no choice. I couldn't warn you. <laughs> yeah. Uh, unless it's literally like he can't disclose or have any kind of a record, kind of text messages or anything. You don't even need to, do, you could say, hey, honey, we've got a guest. Yeah, true, true, true. A friend's kid is staying with yeah. us for a while. I had to keep you in the dark, honey. It's for the drama of the plot. <laughs> she needs to stay here for a while undetected. She has to blend in as a normal American teenager. That's not gonna happen, Dad. She's a princess. Yeah, don't worry. You got a weekend. You can teach her how to be a normal American teenager. Exactly. That's how much time it takes. Tie her hair up and get it to put on some glasses. That always does it. <laughs> if we do our job right, she'll be out of here in no time. Okay, so by Tuesday? It'll be soon. I promise. <laughs> Just have her drop the line. Go back to where you came from. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> come on, no. come on. No. All right. Put me down. Put me down. Right. Be nice. Mm -hmm. 
You have made other sleeping arrangements? No, babe. The fuck? No, dude. The room is not yours. It's ours. Yeah. He really didn't explain that. No. That's the other part he could have done. You get one side of the room, and I get the other. So stay on your side. Yeah, he kind of just brought it here and was like, yeah, check it out. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Lay claim. <laughs> it's what you guys normally do, right? Take shit that's going <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that. Oh, that's good. So I thought princesses had designer clothes and stuff. You should leave all that behind. Loan some of your stuff. Doesn't the protection program supply them with clothes and shit? Like, why should well, yeah. borrow hers? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Last chance to eat something. I wish to sleep. Okay. Cool. So you're just not gonna eat anything? You may help me prepare for bed. The fuck? I may. Yes. Well, she's used to having attendants. That's hilarious. I need a nightgown. Preferably silk. Preferably pink. Yeah. He really could have explained a little more. This dad? He seems like a sweet guy. Mm. Got a good heart? Mm hmm Nothing up here. Oh, absolutely just not. No, nothing rattled around the skull. The perfect soldier. <laughs> Just smart enough to follow orders. Yeah. <laughs> oh, he has done zero repairing of either of these girls. No, the only the only way he could have a saving grace here is if it's like, no, he's doing this deliberately because he just wants the entertainment of watching them fight. <laughs> it's boring out here. <laughs> oh my God. He's just one of those sadistic pieces of shit. Yeah. Like dads who's just like, yeah, my kids, that's my soap opera. Yeah, this is going to be great. <laughs> yeah. Here. Por favor, donde está el baño? Huh? May I use your restroom? Yeah, upstairs, first door on the right. See, you might think she's not pronouncing the Spanish very well, but really, she's putting an American affectation on it in the hopes that she'll understand it better. Right, totally. <laughs> oh, is it all? Yeah, it's a gecko or a lizard of some kind. <laughs> Wait, do Americans have geckos? Do they not have lizards where you're from? I guess some parts, maybe? Yeah. South? Well, mm -hmm. it's a kind of lizard, whatever. Yeah, it's a lizard. But I never see them. That is why we have Henry. You have a royal reptile wrangler? Yes. Well, you would think that they would just have a royal animal team. Handler. Handlers. Probably handlers. The royal Steve Owen. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna be a royal pain. <laughs> oh, actually, she, she's a royal. <clears throat> <laughs> She'd be totally fine if dipshit dad here did anything to yeah. prepare her. Or even the protection program people mm. did anything to like, you know, give her the rundown. Like, isn't that the whole job to protect and I would assume help? They're just too swamped with the number of coups happening <laughs> at the same time. <laughs> it's a revolution across the globe, man. Uh, hey. Juice? Yeah. Yeah. They're short stuffed to, due to over invasioning. Mm -hmm. There you go. Coffee done? Good. How oh, gross, dude. Drink from the carton. Look, I think drinking from the carton is fine when you live alone. Yes. You live by yourself, you go ham. Or you and your partner, because well, you, you kiss. Yeah, <laughs> like, if you, you know, and that's between you and your, like, some people mm. won't share drinks, some people, whatever. Don't do it unless you're comfortable and the other people in the place are comfortable with sharing saliva, basically. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you want to share spit with your new roommate. Yeah. Make sure it's consensual. Make sure they're cool with it too. But that's, you know, that's your business if you want. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, who's this now? My cousin. Hello. Well, aren't you a cutie? I am Rosie. And I am late. Fucking Carter's better prep than her dad. <laughs> <laughs> She's just never been on a bus before. Nope. I, I mean, so. it makes sense, but yeah. it's still funny. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Link established. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> the PPP it's link. So fucking juvenile. Yeah. Stage four is complete. She's safe. That's affirmative. Absolutely safe. Yeah. We'll grow up one day, man. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, after I got my kidney stones removed, I had to reconnect my PPP link. <laughs> <laughs> Would this be the queen? Technically, no. Not yet, anyway. Nice. Ew, a vlogger. <laughs> I'm, I'm Ed, by the way. You're? Rosie. I'm making a documentary. It's useful that this guy is so enamored so quick, and he's obviously going to be harmless, because look at this man. <laughs> <laughs> man oh, that's so brutal. 
Oh, look at him. Just, look, at the, look at this Sigma profile right here. <laughs> well, whatever. He looks harmless. Fucking what does it say? beta energy. <laughs> beta energy. Nothing but. Because <laughs> Carter just ditched her immediately. Oh. She needs some kind of friend. Yes. Completely non-sexually threatening. Yeah. <laughs> God, exactly. <laughs> so rough. <laughs> from humble peasant to homecoming queen. We have no such thing where I'm from. Where's that? I'm from Iowa. What are you doing? I'm going to school. Yeah, how would she have any idea? Just act like a normal American girl and try harder. Why did you not come up with a backstory? Fuck's sake. Oh my God, try to do this thing that you've never come across before. Yeah. You're not involved with, unless she grew up watching American movies. In all fairness, neither of but them even then, should yeah. have had this responsibility to figure this out on the fly. This is true, yes. Once again, it all falls back on dad. Yes. Excuse me. Dickhead. May I have the seat? Get out of the chair. I'm sorry, I think it's school property. Ah, ah. Ew. What? What, what was, was that? What was the, <laughs> what was the breathing part of that? <laughs> ah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Totally. <laughs> yeah, I knew that was going to happen. What? She's hot. Of course. <sighs> That's going to be jealous that this fucking brick. Hey. Paying us attention. What the though. fuck? Yeah. Don't make this kid fucking move. Okay. At least he's supposed to be an asshole. It's probably not going to be the end game shit. Bonjour, Indeed. les étudiants. Comment allez-vous aujourd'hui? This must be a new student. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She speaks perfect French, whatever. Probably speaks like five languages. Makes sense. J'aime le français, l'anglais, l'espagnol, l'italien, le japonais. Okay, the pronunciation doesn't sound good. Uh, English, French, Spanish, Portuguese, Italian, and Japanese. Uh, that oh, what said? Uh, yeah, that's what, that's what she said. Uh, that's what she said? Yeah, yeah, that's right. what that. Yeah, yeah, that's all right. Est-ce que cela vous a plu? D'habiter aux Etats-Unis, Mademoiselle Devereaux? Merci, Rosie. Is that supposed to be embarrassing for you? There's no subtitles on this copy, so I don't know. Where are you, my little princess? Bro, Google Maps will be more practical. Just saying. <laughs> News from Rosalinda? No, and there will never be. Perhaps we should think happy thoughts. Why did they think Soul Patch for this kind of character? Maybe he just had a Soul Patch? He's surprisingly hip. Like the actor. <laughs> they were like, yeah, I guess. Yeah. I'm sure that's why, but it's like, just, oh yeah, he's a, he's a really funky kind of more new wave sort of dictator, you know? <laughs> you will never be the king not as long as I'm alive. Isn't that just an invitation for him to kill you? Yeah, right? Bro. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Back of the line. Pardon? That's, yeah. She doesn't know what lines are. Yeah. No cut. Of course. Come on up with me. No, he, Dick, he just said back of the line. Don't just push her to the front of the line because you yeah, but his like alpha energy was just too much for him to handle. <laughs> but, yeah, for real, you can at least like show her around at lunch. I know, just anything. Just be like, hey man, you can sit with me, mm. you know? You don't have to want to be her friend or whatever, but goddamn. Uh. <laughs> Gotta love the accompanying music that spells out exactly what's happening. Yes. Yeah, I can't keep hammering on about how they just gave no prep to this poor girl. <laughs> I know. Who she thinks she is? She thinks she's Carter's cousin. It's kind of so wild though. It's hard to not keep noticing. Yeah. <laughs> I think the premise of this movie, just don't prepare her at all. Yeah, everything kind of revolves around that, mm -hmm. but it's just such an easy thing that could have been fixed. She may be a loser like her cousin, but she's dangerous. Totally love the hair. Ow! Yeah, like I said, insecure. Very much. What are you doing? Eating. Eating a hamburger. Have you ever tried one? FYI, they have hamburgers in Iowa. So, she hasn't been to Iowa. Yeah. You're supposed to be blending in. Didn't tell her how! You say we need to move past the whole they didn't prepare her at all, but it's the whole yeah, story. Like, like you said, it keep. Yeah, it. Wow, God. <laughs> oh. Kind of sitting here just being like, Dude, how are you not fitting in? Try harder to fit in. This is gonna be the whole video, isn't it? Yes. It's just us going, what the fuck? <laughs> I am blending. Speaking fluent French and eating hamburger like you're having tea with the queen. Bro, she doesn't know what a normal American kid is. Yeah. Like, how is she supposed to know this shit? Yeah, precisely. There you go. Yeah, see? Show her. You could have just done that to begin with mm -hmm. without the attitude. Mm, stop. <laughs> Pinkies. Ow. 
Yeah, the pinkies thing actually doesn't matter at all. I it's, do it involuntarily. I do it sometimes too. No one ever told me to do it. I just, it just happens. Sometimes, yeah. It's not weird. It's, mm. Some people do that. On Monday, taking nominations for the homecoming court. Must be girls of exemplary character. Good luck with that. Wait, are they trying to draw like a parallel to like this and the, yeah, the princess thing? Probably. And, yes, because members of royalty are all like that, right? <laughs> On Friday night at our annual dance, one of these girls will be crowned your homecoming queen. Thank you. Cool. Um, okay, I, need, I guess I need to clear something up. Do they have homecoming king and tween, queen twice? It's like a junior prom and a senior prom? Uh, well, no, not junior. It'd be like sophomore? Sophomore is like year 10. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, oh, that's a, that's a sophomore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe, I guess so. It's kind of like how we, we had a year 10 social. Yeah, but it's just a dance. And then we had a year 12 formal. I mean, to be fair, so we, did, this. We, we don't have a king and queen of the, the no, dance. No, we don't. <laughs> king you know. and queen of the dance. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> the lords of the dance. Exactly. <laughs> I thought that there was only like a end of high school mm. prom with a king and queen. But I, I guess they do the king and queen thing twice. <laughs> yeah, well. I guess so. You vote for royalty here? We're a democracy. We're into voting. Anyone can be a princess? Even you? <laughs> That's where we're going with this? You're, so you're bang on. 100% uh, where they're going with this. Excuse me, everyone. May I have your attention? Oh, no. No. I would like to nominate my cousin to be your queen. I think that she would make an excellent ruler. At least she was trying to be nice. Yeah. It's actually like it's kind of hard to be embarrassed by considering no one prepared her for this. Yeah. It's like I'm the queen. <laughs> Easy to be embarrassed, uh, just hard to be angry about it. <laughs> well, actually, honestly, like I had a half second of, oh no, don't do that. And then I was like, mm. but you know what? Fuck all these people. Yeah, true. She doesn't know shit. This is with the benefit of being well out of high school and in Fair. high sight, realizing, wow, yes. none of that mattered, huh? Yeah. Carter, I order you to stop. <laughs> she just clocks her in the face. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? She can't act normal. I am normal. <laughs> a normal person who has never seen a hamburger can order one in six languages. Oh, it is relative. Yeah, I was gonna say. You did that? I always speak to my staff in their native tongue. Why do you not know these things? Incompetent asshole. Can't you see that this isn't gonna work? We just have to give it a little time. Oh God, it's not even that he's unprepared. This the whole organization's unprepared. Yeah. <laughs> they didn't prepare him. He didn't prepare her. So the whole chain's are screwed. Just incompetence all the way up to mm. the top. Oh, that tracks. Mm. Yes. That could, yeah, really. Right. Does. <laughs> Whoa, this movie's a lot deeper than I gave it credit for. Damn. <laughs> so many layers. Yeah. Of stupid. Yeah. <laughs> just pull one back, just more and more. <laughs> but yeah, okay. She's homesick. Yeah, Makes sense. Sure. You get a real moment from her. Yeah. As far as she knows, her mom could be dead. <laughs> ah, yeah. That would be a real conflict. Sure, they're not going to get into that. No. Yeah. That would make this a good movie. <laughs> What are you doing? Chores? I do not understand. Of course not. You could say work. She might get that. You could teach me. Yeah, fuck yeah. Do mm. all my work for me. Oh yeah. That's the best idea you've had. We'll start you off easy. Inventory. Utilize the foreign labor. <laughs> Count what's in here, and when you're done, there's a whole other shelf too. Oh wow, what a crazy amount of work. Yeah, I was gonna say, that doesn't actually seem like that much overall. Nah, I guess it's the worm situation. Mm. Oh no. Why, dude? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That sounds about right. What's Rosie doing in the bait shop? Helping. Unsupervised. Yeah. Without proper direction. Oh, well, the good news here is now you guys have extra work to do. Yeah. I think I need to bathe. Yeah. Sure. Fair enough. I'm not that bothered by worms, but... Nah. Fair enough. Clean this up, okay? Why me? She's the one who did it. Come on, pal. I'll help you. Yeah, you screwed up. Come on, man. It's not funny. <laughs> yeah, that's a little funny. All right, here. Yeah, it is funny. Hey, as long as you guys are enjoying how much extra work you have to do. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Uh, it wasn't that serious. She wasn't badly hurt or anything like that. Well, yeah, who cares about that? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Aw, isn't that nice? Aww. What's all this? A proper dinner. She has some skills. She's trying to be nice. To thank you for helping me clean up the mess that I made in your shop of bugs. <clears throat> it's bait. I'm aware. She's not wrong. Yeah. <laughs> it is a shop of bugs. You sell bugs, don't you fucking lie to me. <laughs> Tonight, I serve you. I'm not gonna say no to that. Interesting, were you taught how to do this by your staff? Yeah, that is interesting. How are you really competent with this one thing? What does this have to do with your role as a princess and leader? Yeah. You cook, 
I thought you had servants for that. My mother grew up a peasant, so she taught me many family recipes. Ah, oh, she got it from mom. Okay, well, no, that's that cool. Sense. Mm. Little bit of backstory. See, she's down to earth. They're just like us. That sounds kind of fancy. Why don't we just order pizza? Right. What? It's chicken and rice. <laughs> Wait, I haven't had a real home cooked meal since forever. Right. Yeah, buddy, you know, to have a home cooked meal, you need to cook at home. Mm, yeah. Like, you are the parent here? He's just too busy being a dad, you know? Sure. This is terrific. You're wonderful. <laughs> Would you like a roll? You made ro rolls too. Yes. Hold on. She made rolls? Must be nice to play peasant for a day. Oh my god. Bro. Like, I was going to say something nice. <laughs> up until this point, Do you excuse me? Carter has been like, eh, but not necessarily a bitch. Just yeah, yeah. Eh, a little annoying or whatever. She's mm. been fine. Understandable. That was uncool. Yeah, no. Nah, not called for. Yeah. Seems like there's a sore spot about her mum they're probably leading up to. Yeah. At least she recognizes. She seems to recognize that she kind of fucked up there. <laughs> yeah, maybe. You do not know me, Carter. That's true. She didn't know shit. You'll be back with your servants and your personal chef soon enough. Are you just mad because she's rich? My name is Rosalinda Fiore, and I'm a royal princess. What other kind of princess would you be? Yeah. I'm from a small island nation called Costa Luna. Never heard of it. It is not on most maps. Damn. It is very small. So they're really not rich at all. No. Very important to me. Well, the country's not rich. Yeah, that's what I mean. <laughs> the, the, the family, though. Uh, yeah, they, they, they took all the wealth. Yeah. When my father died, he left Costa Luna to me. You don't have to tell me. One month before our palace was attacked. I don't know, I feel like she does have to tell you this stuff. Yeah, you are making a lot of assumptions. Mm. Your father was very brave. It's his job. He rescues poor oppressed princesses. <laughs> did he tell you we had to leave my mother behind? He did not. The man who invaded Costa Luna now holds her as a hostage. He basically told her nothing. Yeah. In fact, he told both of you pretty much nothing. Yeah. By becoming Rosie Gonzalez was the only way to keep her safe. Stop. I don't know. I think it's important for her to keep telling you this. Yeah. Whatever I did to make you dislike me, I'm truly sorry. The full scope. Then you can judge her. <laughs> <laughs> I will try to blend in. I'm not saying don't rub her privilege in her face. Yeah. Just do so knowingly. Yeah. Do it with all the facts. Yeah. Yeah, see, if someone is not being a privileged dick, I don't have an issue with their privilege. Exactly. Let's just start over. I would like that. To clear that up, mm. there's having privilege and behaving privileged. Yes. They're not necessarily the same thing. They're both a function of privilege, obviously. Yeah, yeah. But it's basically just like, you can have a lot of stuff and not mm. be a dick about it. Yeah, pretty much. It's a very important distinction. And it's you know? basically mm. why just having privilege and being born into it mm. a lot of time where you didn't actually get a say in it yeah. doesn't automatically make you a bad person. Exactly. It's how you behave yeah. with that privilege and what you do with it that exactly. counts for more. You know? And that is the thing so far with this character is just like I get that you're like mad about your situation and she's super rich and you're not really poor but I guess you're in a poor area yeah she's working class <laughs> seems to be doing alright your dad's got a good job yeah <laughs> the fuck he's got he's got, he's got uh, government benefits and yeah, shit he was military he's a fucking secret agent exactly fuck <laughs> off <laughs> but <laughs> you know she wasn't being a mm. brat of any kind she wasn't no. being disrespectful yeah, she was yeah. just Unaware? Ignorant mo for the most yeah. part. You need to lighten up on this princess stuff. Absolutely. I only want to be this typical American teenager. <laughs> oh, she's so desperate to try and make this work. He's trying. I think we can arrange that. Yeah, see, this is just what should have happened from the get-go. I love this. What is it? Bowling alley. It's an okay bowling alley. Do what I do and don't draw any attention. I haven't been in one ages. It's so damn expensive. Yeah, bowling costs too much these days. It used to be an affordable thing. Yeah, it used to be a not. cheap night out. Yeah. Here anyway, Sydney. What'll it be? Bowling, please. <laughs> but yeah, it's a bummer that a real lack of third party places. Thank you. Sure. Places where people just gather for general yeah. social these days. What size? Oh, um, I do not know. I'll just get her some shoes. Guys, could you just assume she's roughly the same size as Cardo? It doesn't take that much to figure it out. You kind of just put your feet next to each other and be like, yeah, yeah. Similar. Um. 
She's waiting for him to put the shoes on. Yeah, that's oh. um. Uh, he's into it. Lo- oh god, I'm amazed. Oh god, we got a Quentin Tarantino on our hands. <laughs> <laughs> Foot guy. Yeah. Oh. It's been a pleasure serving you, right, lady. Thank you. I'm amazed that he fucking figured it out. He realized. You I know, know what if I mean? he realized, or if he's just leaning into how she's behaving. No, that's what I mean. He saw her sitting on the counter. And was like, oh, she wants me to put the shoes on her. Oh, that part figured out. Yeah. Uh, Where? Uh, like, wouldn't you see like a girl sitting on the counter and be like? What are you doing? Uh, Zephyr was watching Specific. Converse. Yeah. Had someone, uh, a mom come in, yeah. her kid, and the kid went to put on the shoes yeah. and the mom said, no, 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 that's their job. Yeah. I've had adults say that when I was a kid. Yeah. It's fucking weird. Even as a child, I was like, no, what? I can put on my own damn shoes. Yeah. Thank you very much. You're not blending in, pick a ball. Nobody ever does that for us. Thank you now. Probably because you guys suck. Yeah. <clears throat> Oh, uh, your shoe's untied. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta start by being sweet and yeah. nice and lovable. You don't have to carry that for her. She can do it herself, like a normal person. This is what you say. Carter. What? Dude, dude. Weren't you giving her rides to school and everything? Well, no. He, uh, yeah. <laughs> so Danny is your boyfriend? No, no, he's just a friend. He's, is he a friend? Not really a friend. Yeah. I see the way you look at him. The same way that Ed looks at you. Aww. You're obviously not from here, so just bull. What she's talking about actually has nothing to do with where anyone's from. Yeah, people like people. Oh, well, a different kind of courting expectations. Uh, different different expectations, from. but the look yeah. of attraction yeah. is the look of attraction. Attraction is attraction. What? You may fire at the target. You may fire it yourself. Anyone want to teach this girl how to bowl? Mm. She's just going to watch by staring at everybody else. Cool. Well, she picked that up immediately. I guess it's not that complicated. Impossible. Okay, it's not. Bowling is not crazy. (laughs) Okay, Okay. doing it like that much? Yeah, that is pretty crazy. (laughs) Swear to God, if she plays a perfect game, that'll be another story. Mm, Yeah. Leaning a bit hard on the princess leaving. thing. Done already, Carter? Yeah, our lane's getting a little crowded. Okay, seriously, I don't think people gather to watch people bowl like this. I wouldn't know. <laughs> Point taken. You don't really like your cousin, do you? She can be sometimes a princess. We can't let her get more popular than we are. Man, if she gets more popular than you guys in the span of a couple of days, you, you are failing at yeah. being popular to begin with. I like to think that they actually never were. Yeah. They're just that deluded. <laughs> Bro! We show us how to bowl like that. But my name is Rosie. Rose, our nickname we gave you. The nickname of a nickname. You're one of us now. Eventually her name will just be Ru- <laughs> Why do you care so much for this boy, Donnie? Good question. Mostly because he doesn't give her the, the attention that she wants, I'd assume. And he's tall and attractive. I was going to say the conventionally attractive part. Yeah. I've been totally in love with him since third grade when he kissed me under the basketball hoop. He's quite beautiful. Much like a prince. I think he looks like a brick. <laughs> That's fair. Shall we bowl again tomorrow? I'm working at the bait shack. I've never worked before and I will help you. You can't. Yes, well, she can if someone teaches her. You can't yeah. have everything that's mine. Mm. Oh my God, dude. Want a job so bad, just, just go get one yourself. All right. Okay, whatever's going on in Carter's life, I guess it kind of makes sense now that I'm thinking about her dipshit dad. Yeah. <laughs> Doing the whole stop taking over my life thing. Uh, she's a teenager. I can only fucking like fault her so much for it, you know? Well, yeah, but a teenager whose dad is like, Barely available yeah, as they, a dad. They even, he seems even more, more like just a buddy. I know, right? He's a friend. Yeah. Thank you for giving me this job, Chelsea. Daddy owns like 17 idolies all over the South. You have to wear this. See, I'm sure that was supposed to be embarrassing then, but I could literally imagine mm-hmm. kids wearing that now. Yeah, you really don't <laughs> see the problem. Hats with the little spinny bit on top. Yeah. Had a, had a moment. Absolutely. So sure. nothing's impossible as far as I'm concerned. A future homecoming princess. Who is this natural beauty, you ask? Go oh, away, I'm working. I love how so right. many movies have that one weird kid who just films everything. You really hate this whole princess thing, don't you? Chelsea and Brooke, all they care about is shoes. But you also care about those things. I just want to do something more important with my life. Oh, shit. It's so funny because, yeah, like the costume department kind of fucked up. She's not like bumming around in like work clothes and shit. She's wearing nice clothes. <laughs> Pause. Yeah, it's not like she's crazy dressed up or anything. Yeah. But she's clearly a person who cares about her appearance, which would be fine. Yeah, Nothing yeah. wrong with that. Mm. But this whole like... I don't care about shallow aesthetic things. And like, I just want to do something real with my life. Mm. 
I'm sure they're trying to go for like a, they meet in the middle, you know, she oh. undervalues it and Rosa overvalues it. And whoa, there's a balance in between guys. But yeah, again, I think the costume department fucked up by dressing her the way they did. I've been waiting here for like 10 minutes. Oh no. Dude, just lift it. Yeah, just up. put it back. Just put it back up. She's dying in there. Do me a huge favor. Uh, yeah. What? Hold on. Okay. The guy's t-shirt was fucking great. It said, Rook et Roll. Yeah. <laughs> it's big. It's red. She keeps managing to draw all these crowds. There's no manager. There's no one here besides this new girl who just got hired today. <laughs> Okay. What kind of store manager's like, yeah, I'm going to leave my store in, in the capable hands of this random teenager? Yeah. Who's here for the first day? <laughs> the fact that there would be a line out the door because uh, people are not getting their fucking, you know, ice cream. At uh, this point, people, yeah, but the fact that it, this was possible. <laughs> She's just oh, trying damn. to eat it now. Oh, damn. <laughs> She's going for gold. <laughs> yeah, the fact that it's possible in the first place. How is there nobody here to help her? How is there no one in charge of the store? Yeah. <laughs> I could get it to decom and stuff, but I'm like, seem hey, better. <laughs> all, all decoms stretch things a little bit, mm. but like, there's a line. Yeah. What are you doing? Are you okay? You said to get a job. This job's for losers. How the fuck is she meant to know that? Yeah, if you don't help her. Chelsea sets you up. I'm not a fool. She cannot make something out of me that I am not. Whereas we have to uh. do something. Yeah, she's going to take the high road. Hmm. Because that is what princesses do. <laughs> yeah, of course. For sure. Could have seen that one coming. Your father, the king of yogurts, will be very disappointed in you. And her dad's cool with her letting this door get destroyed like this? Fair. She's not. But yeah. yeah, that part, you'd think he'd at least be pretty pissed, but I don't know, man. Oh, some, you know what? Nah, I've met some fucking parents who whatever. really do just let their kids do whatever. And if she gets in a vote, she could become queen. I'm the queen. It's my destiny. Sure. Okay. Whatever, man. I'd rather eat carbs than see her wearing my crown. Dude, you eat carbs every fucking day. Everybody does. <laughs> yeah. They're almost impossible to avoid. Yeah. You can eat very low carbs, but you mm. have to really try. Yeah. It's never too late to learn. I'm ready to try. <clears throat> Love how they have a version of more or less the same outfit. It must be nice to be a queen. It's not all about the dresses and crowns. My father never called himself king. He was father, brother, He's and friend. Too down to earth for that, you know? Yeah. Billionaires, they're just like you and me. Absolutely. I want to make a difference. To do something more important with your life. Cool. So this is where they relate, huh? Mm. Uh, now you finally see her. A princess is never sure who her true friend is. Today, I'm sure. Me too. I guess that part would suck. Even just being exceptionally rich. Oh, yeah. Number of... Uh, fake people hanging on to you for the sake of proximity. Well, this is something I've tried to talk about in the past where it's hard to understand privilege if you've never had it from exactly that perspective. Mm -hmm. You don't know how isolated it can be. Yeah, for sure. You know? and that doesn't mean hold, don't hold privileged people accountable no. for the other shit, but just be aware. Well, it's just that like being privileged doesn't mean you don't have problems. Yeah. I will never marry you ever. <laughs> well, you could be forced to. Mm. But Rosalinda will not know this. She will see the announcement. Oh. And come racing back to her mother's side. I mean, if she's smart, she won't come racing back at all. Is she? <laughs> well, her protector is supposed to be, but I guess he's not really. Yeah, here, yeah. So. <laughs> yeah she's a teenager. That's understandable. Yeah. He's a dumbass. <laughs> yeah. And your princesses are Chelsea Barnes. Considering how ambivalent my school was towards just the dancers period mm. i really struggle to connect to how this stuff can be such a big deal of course you yeah, know? completely agree carter mason well our schools were not that you know into it to begin with and i wasn't into the amount of into it that they were yeah third and final princess is rosie gonzalez yeah shock who could have seen that one coming? Watch Mean Girls. It's just a piece of plastic. <laughs> yeah. okay? You need to hear that speech. Mm. <laughs> this is all your fault. If you're more popular, you'd be the princess. Who the fuck actually works like this? I don't know. I am popular! I gotta assume that there's not that many people 
like it's not like a normal thing to be like this anymore because people have seen this kind of shit and be like, oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, for sure. If a big company is displaying it in, in a yeah. movie, then yeah, it's probably out of touch at this point. <laughs> I talked to you. Me? Her? Will you go to the dance with me, Rosie? No. Fuck off. That is very kind of you, but <laughs> oh. no. We excuse me. Yeah. <laughs> I love how she's just like, nah. That's very nice, but no. chicks before dicks, as they say. <laughs> that was the most oh. humiliating thing that has ever happened to me. Uh, it didn't really seem humiliating, just kind of a bummer. Also, he sucks. Yeah, so it's a plus for you. Should be more humiliating for Rosa. <laughs> <laughs> he is not worthy of you. But I'm just a girl who sells bait. You are a princess now. You're a princess who sells bait. <laughs> <laughs> when I came here, you taught me how to act normal, not royal. Now it is my turn to teach you. Sure. You think that being a princess is superficial? It's because you only see the superficial things about being a princess. Mm. Sure. sure. Most of the job is appearances, literally my definition. Sure. A little bit about how you look, but more importantly, it is about what you have to offer the world. Uh, I guess that's more about being a ruler, not specifically yeah. a princess. Let's go find your inner princess. Oh, get the fuck over yourself. I give my shit to thrift shops all the damn time. You're not special. Who in this town had that to begin with? I think that's a wedding dress. Right? So, oh, a wedding dress from the 80s. Yeah. That makes it one yeah. of their moms had. Yeah, exactly. Sure. It's just a confusing look for a prom. Yeah. Most of these are. I love how like the dress up montages in this movies, like they always have to go through a bunch of outfits that make no sense. Yeah, like really trash. <laughs> Super far off the mark. Yay, twinsies. This fucking music is killing me. <laughs> yes, yeah, it's not a good song. One and the same. You're just so good with everybody. Didn't you know we're just, just we're just like each other? Yeah. Totally right. With the same deep down. Mm -hmm. It is a princess's job to help. Yes, I never really thought about what it <laughs> really means. You never thought about the idea of it as a job. Yeah. I can't believe you actually have to do this. Oh, no, you don't. I hate you. I'm like, you're my best friend. Oh. That's a lot. Neurotypical nonsense. The fuck? <laughs> yeah. Well, then I hate you too. And that dress is ugly. It is? No. But it's beautiful. And so are you. I do appreciate that they picked two very similar girls to play this role. <laughs> These yeah. Roles. They're so different, but so the same. No, they're not that different. So it's almost like they wanted to go for a Prince and the Pauper thing, but yes. like kind of didn't quite go there. Yeah, Disney really struggles at portraying the Prince and the Pauper idea. Yeah. I had this lame writing assignment for Spanish. Do you think that he has something that's really easy with lots of pictures? Wow. Jesus. <laughs> I love the look on her face like, yeah. oh, okay. Oh, cool. Oh, that's right. That's how she finds out. Oh, from a magazine? Yeah. Princess Rosalinda? Okay. Really makes it seem like they should have done a much more thorough job of uh, hiding her better. Yeah, I agree. No way. I hate to be mean, but she's got kind of an annoying voice. I feel like it's put on. Yeah, but... It For the sake of the character? It could be legit, though. I hope it's not. I feel bad if it is. I feel real bad. I'm just bullying this whole girl. <laughs> General Kane's announcement of his engagement has popped up. She'd never agree to marry him. General Kane's doing this to draw Rosalinda out. Well, now you're smart. I was just thinking that exact thing. <laughs> Fuck <Yeah>. you. <laughs> He's like one of those dudes who like pretends to be incompetent and stuff so that people won't ask him to do things. <laughs> Anyone who might want to expose her identity? Not that I know of. He knows he's a shit dad. Yeah. He's just like, yeah, but no one will expect me yeah. to be going better. <laughs> Got it all figured out. <laughs> and let's hang some lights directly on it. That might be too harsh on my skin tone. We should hire a lighting designer. Why do you have to hire a lighting? designer instead of just playing with the lights. Mm -hmm. It's great to be queen. You're not queen yet. Most of pre and post production is just figuring out what you like about making a thing. Yeah. Can it, Muffy? <laughs> My name's Margaret. Not anymore. Aww. I gotta just make a quick point because it always just makes me laugh whenever I see it that in movies like these, particularly Disney movies, mm -hmm. where they've got to try to portray princesses and royalty in, in a positive light, mm -hmm. it's always someone who's not royalty, a commoner yeah. who's 
the terrible person who embodies all the negative stereotypes associated with royalty. I know. When it's like, I mean, like, maybe, yeah, but what fucking power would they even have? Like, what what impact would they have with an actual royal who is actually like that? Sure. <laughs> you know? Yeah, yeah, totally. It's just so funny. Mm-hmm. Hey, Chels. Don't call me that. You lost that right when you lost your princess crown to Bake Girl. Good God, if you're going to turn on the only friends you have, what's the point? Yeah. Well, what if we could get Rosie to drop out of homecoming altogether? She's Princessa Rosalinda. I'm going to cause an international incident for the sake of prom. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. The dad literally just, like, calls in. They get black bags. <laughs> <laughs> Take it to a government facility. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Mason. Is Rosie home? We're planning a little princess surprise for Carter. She's in her room. Go on in. See, yeah. once again, back to being stupid. What the fuck? See, he just wants the drama. Yeah. Again, he just wants the drama. He's like, he knows they bully her. Oh my he God. Knows. Yeah, he knows. That's what the <laughs> smile on his face yeah. was. He looked at her like, yeah, this is going to be funny. He's going to get so many clicks. <laughs> Poor Princess Rosalinda. Did you hear she's in hiding? You do not understand. I understand that you lied to us. Only to protect my mother. For real. The yeah. storyline is these girls are literally prepared. It, like, people die because yeah, yeah. Yeah, they're in another country. It's mm. not our problem. Prom. That's mm-hmm. what matters. You know what? It's a stretch, but uncomfortable by how it's not that much of a stretch. I know. Especially the, oh, that's another country. I don't give a shit about that. I know. <laughs> You're going to tell everyone that there is one true homecoming queen. You may take my crown, but you will not take Carter's. <laughs> Let Bake Girl play princess for one night. She just won't look like one. Honestly, you would think at this point, you're like, I don't care about this prom. My mom's life and like other members of my family and stuff, they could all die. Yeah. It's like they're in danger. It's actually kind of pathetic that you think this is a big enough deal to blackmail me over it. Yeah. (laughs) Have fun at the dance. The fuck? Also, um, those dresses are probably fine. Yeah, they Maybe just got dropped. Get a little she, dirt on them. Touching them? Oh, oh, oh she, just, she threw them in a puddle. Threw them in a puddle. Okay. Sure. Didn't realize where she was tossing them. Yeah, <laughs> I guess it, it does make, make sense. Yeah. Look at what Chelsea and Brooke did. I have to leave, Carter. Leave, leave where? Leave here, obviously. The place she's at. Yeah. Where else would she leave from? <laughs> General Kane is forcing my mother into marriage. My father's never going to let you go back. He'll never know. Um, how are you going to go back without him? Yeah. How are you going to go back, period? You're a minor. <laughs> Don't think you have any money. And I'm not going to let you go back either. I have a duty to my people, and this is something that you'll never understand. And I wish my life could be like this every day. Things no one said in 2023. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you think my life as a princess is some fairy tale? Well, she doesn't anymore. Yeah, clearly not. You guys have had this growing already. This here is a fairy tale, and I cannot hide here anymore. This is a fairy what? Okay, this is definitely not a fairy tale. No. Not at all. My country needs me. They need you to lead them and to protect them. And to not be dead. And that's something you can't do from jail, which is exactly where you'll end up. Oh, yes, death. jail. That's the concern. Mm. Not death. No, but no, no. decom. I it's get a decom. It. <laughs> they don't kill people on these. <laughs> but yeah, there's definitely the problem with having like a fucking... No way am I letting this happen. ...military coup of like a small nation... Mm. In a decom. Yeah. Interesting choice. <laughs> Far too serious for this kind of fucking movie. Yeah. See, if they had gone with the, like, evil uncle sure. thing, sure. that could maybe be campy enough to yeah. be like, yeah, all right, they're not going to kill anyone. Even the Lion King had death. <laughs> I'm a friend of Princess Rosalinda. She's about to make a very big mistake. She wants to come home. She must not. It's demasiado peligroso. It's too dangerous. But I have a plan. Yeah. Wouldn't your plan involve... Just telling your dad instead of calling this fucking guy? Yeah. I'm gonna need two dresses. I'm going to miss this place. Seriously, there's no way that missing this place is the main concern. Yeah. Her mother's life is on the line. Mm-hmm. This is really bugging me. Yeah. <laughs> going to miss you, Carter. Can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm gonna miss you too. Well, they can't go for five minutes without trying to tell the audience just how much better living in America is to anywhere else, even if you're a princess or queen. Yeah. Dance is on Friday night, and there's some people that I want to help. Will you please stay until then? For them, please? Yeah, because this matters more than the lives of your fucking family and countrymen. I swear to God. Yeah. (laughs) Stay for the prom. Yeah, yeah. Your mom can die. Morning, Dad. Morning. What are you girls up to? Oh, just having some friends over from school. Is that okay? See, you don't know anything. He really doesn't. You never know what's going on. How are you so unaware? 
how are you as like a, a secret service agent? <laughs> yeah. That's how they know they can trust him with classified information. He's like, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> this one is yours. And this one is mine. Thank you, Carter. This is a night I'll always remember. I hope so. Yeah, you guys will remember it for sure. Mm -hmm. Are you guys ready? Because it's getting kind of late. Yeah. So everyone's getting makeovers together, I guess. That what's happening here? I can't remember where this goes or what the plan is. Not feeling it. Me either. Don't like that dress. The gloves are what are really killing it for me. The dress is also not fantastic, but damn, those gloves. How do I look, Dad? Don't like long sleeve gloves in general. I may have to stop calling you pal. You probably shouldn't have been calling her that to begin with, but whatever. <sighs> um, it's just the cut of her dress. Fair. All right, I gotta grab this. The girl's gonna be okay? Yeah, we'll be fine. I think it's weirder that he'd stop because, oh, you're too pretty now to be my pal. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know? Well, I, okay, to be fair, I think he's thinking because you're all grown up now. Sure. The dance starts in 10 minutes. Are they seriously going to go for, like, the switcheroo? Yeah, I would say they're going to go for the switcheroo. Yeah, see, they look alike, not that alike. Yeah. Well, behind the mask. Behind the mask, sure. But one is actually much taller. Like, yeah. <laughs> you can tell they have different body types. Yeah. Yep, getting off the old bus in style. They're just the weirdos who showed up in masks. Yeah, like it's not a mask ball at no. all. I kind of get the masks that you like hold up. They're like half a mask and they're not, yeah. you're not really wearing it all the time. Yeah, it's more just for decoration. But, but the full face mask? Well, especially when you did your whole face. Like, come on. Yeah. Waste. I don't see anything about masks. Nice work, dickhead. Open the door, Donnie! Donnie! He's too enraptured. <laughs> be honest, he never pays attention to anything anyway. True. <laughs> oh. Are you okay, my queen? This is fucking <laughs> sweet, dude. Get off! Oh! Ew, don't touch me, simp. Nah, he's just a nice guy. Fucking make a move, bro. Shooting high, he looks like he's half her fucking age. I know. <laughs> I think I can take it. Well, he tried. Yeah, he shot his shot. He did. That's half the battle. Yeah. No. Yeah, yeah. actually. Carter, what's the problem? I thought we had something. Your dick. That's the problem. Actually, we don't. Isn't this what you've been waiting for since like third grade? Oh my God. Ew. Dude, the fact that you know that. Yeah, is right? Before I put on this dress. And that you only care now? You couldn't even remember my name. I might be a princess tonight, but I'll always be Bagel. And I'm proud of that. Big pride. You're making a big mistake. I don't think I am. No, Donnie, you're a big mistake. <laughs> better than him, Carter. Too bad it took this long to realize it. Well, I mean, better late than never, and you're only like 16, so whatever. True. And is someone gonna dance with Super Tall Boy? <laughs> Super Tall Boy. Because he looks uncomfortable mm. there by himself. <laughs> he looks so exposed and fragile <laughs> without his camera. <laughs> Did you give me a crown? Who cares? In a few minutes, it won't matter anyways. I'll be named Queen, and this will all be over. I thought we were in this together. We are. No, obviously yeah. not. Lip gloss. No. What? <laughs> A princess is supposed to be a girl of exemplary character. I don't even kind, honest, or charitable in any way. You're only just realizing this now? I don't think I want to be your friend anymore. Or yeah. is it only a problem because she's mean to you? Yeah. Oh, rookie. Don't call me that. Like, it's fine when she's mean to other people. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Now that she's on the receiving end of it, she's like, wow, being mean to people sucks. Right? It just doesn't feel good. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go again. Why don't you two go ahead and be princess? You don't understand this. Yeah, how did this not cause an international incident? I'm the- Security, uh, I know. How did her dad, who wasn't informed about- it, What is with the uniforms? I know her dad didn't know because he doesn't know fucking anything. Yeah. But this whole princess protection program, the US government period, a, a foreign military force arrives mm -hmm. at a school in, in Louisiana yeah. and they don't know about it. No one fucking knows. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't even look like they tried to be stealth. Yeah. They didn't come in like no. balaclavas and shit. No, they knew they knew that they had to be like, we can't actually show how they get in because yeah, yeah. that'll just be too much. They just have to be there. I mean, budget <laughs> bison here didn't even change. He's looked exactly like the dictator that he is. They could have at least shown up in like normal suits and pretended to yeah. be like, you know, do the whole like act natural or your mom gets it, right? you know, yeah, kind of thing. No, no, he's just going to turn up exactly who he is. Like everyone knows it's cool with his cape. I'm allowed all. to be here. Yeah. <laughs> just stay out here and make sure no one gets in that dance. Got it. 
Well, at least he took the one opportunity for someone to believe that they were supposed to be there. Yeah. Not like it means much, considering he's still dressed like Budget Bison. Yep. <laughs> budget Bison. <laughs> About to announce the winner. Let's put on our masks. <laughs> Seriously. These guys just straight up walked into this school. Ah. It's not even a parent near the door like, hey, who the fuck are you guys? Yeah, chaperone, yeah. teachers, anyone, someone, the janitor. Keep these weird adults away from the kids, maybe. Mm -hmm. Go with me now, princess, and no harm will come to your friend. This is not subtle. Yeah, not remotely. Also, yeah, you're right. That She doesn't look like her. Even with a mask on, you'd be able to tell. Yeah, she's taller and thinner. Yeah. The name of our winner is Rosie Gonzalez. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, of course she got voted in. Yeah, naturally. It was either going to be her or Carter. Mm -hmm. Old mate didn't even think to get her to take off the mask just to be sure. Mm -hmm. But I guess it really does show us here exactly how much Carter has not thought this through if her plan is just to be swapped out. Yeah. Since I've been here, I've learned many wonderful things. Like, I'll take her place. It'll be fine. Yeah. And then nothing bad will happen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've learned about friendship and trust. Those are not things that are just given. You sure have. Your friend's just giving up her life for you right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But things we must earn. I've really learned about how your subjects' lives can be used in place of yours as bargaining chips. <laughs> so I want to thank Carter Mason. Like a real queen. Yeah. <laughs> Carter, where are you? Oh yeah, of course, because she has no idea about the plan. Nope. Oof, bummer. Carter's gone lone wolf. Mm -hmm. And seriously, no one thought to tell dad. How the fuck did a helicopter land? Mm. In the fucking basketball court in this high school, no one knows it. There's no local law enforcement of any kind. No, no. That was so beautiful, thank you. I need to find Carter. Oh, there are cops just watch it land like, damn, that's crazy. So no, it turns and just out. just do nothing. Her dad pulls double duty as the town sheriff, <laughs> yeah. the secret agent. See, that would make sense. <laughs> yeah, he's just bad at his job. Yeah. Hold it right there, princess. My crown, hand it over. Are you fucking serious? You lost. Yeah. Also, What's the point of the crown? Yeah, who cares? Like, yeah, take it, you weirdo. What do you think you're getting from it? <laughs> What? Why do you want this crown so badly? Why keep it? Isn't the getting voted in as the winner more, yeah. more important? General Kane! Just take it off, toss it in the pool, like, there you go. Yeah, enjoy. <laughs> Fetch. It appears as if everyone wants to be a princess. Ah, dipshit. Yeah. What are you doing? The plan is working perfectly. This was a very brave plan. I don't believe this. I'm seeing double. Four princesses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I appreciate that she's basically just like, dude, what are you doing? Yeah. You can't trade yourself for me. Stop Come on, it. man. This isn't gonna work. Yeah. This is my fight, not yours. You don't have to go with me. Enough. It should be her dad's fight, though. This yeah. is, like, literally his job. It's his fucking job. Like, <laughs> damn, bro. How can you fumble the ball this bad? Ah, uh, okay, they had him in on that. You are interfering with official business. No. No? I think he just figured it out of himself. Okay. We're turning you over to the international authorities. Get him. No, let me. Well, I mean, yeah, he was stupid enough to just fly in here without any kind of secrecy. Yeah, sure. Okay, thank you. Finally, something that makes sense. Yeah, finally the dad actually <laughs> proved that he got his job for a reason. Yes. <laughs> Someone hired him because he's competent. Yeah, he's like, wow, this asshole really just flew in here with a fucking cape and everything? <laughs> yeah. This is gonna be super easy. Not so hot. I can let my daughter take care of part of this. <laughs> I'll let my daughter's stupid plan get about halfway yeah. and then I'll come in and fix yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I can't even do this for me. That's what princesses do. You are truly a princess now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're all princesses. Yes. Everyone's a princess. And when everyone's a princess, <laughs> no one is. <laughs> Nobody moves. I'll take that. This girl just straight up ignored the armed guards yeah. the first time, which was weird enough, but still now, there's mm -hmm. still men running around here with weapons. I'm in so much trouble. Like anybody should be reasonably afraid of guns. Yeah. Yeah. Although I'm aware it's a bit of a cultural thing. No, I know. Depending where you're from. What were you thinking, Carter? Yeah, good question. Yeah, that's a good question. I was thinking I'd be perfect bait. Why didn't you just come to me? You would have never let me do it. Yeah, it's his job. Yeah, he would have been like, yeah, I would have gotten someone who's actually trained to do this to do it, yeah. you know? Mm -hmm. It's not hard to just disguise yourself as a teenager at a prom. <laughs> you were wearing a fucking mask and everything. Yeah. You rescue princesses. You and me, pal. You and me, dad. 
He gets dressed up in the dress with the mask. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, please, this is weird. Shut up, Carter, I'm serving. <laughs> Rosalinda Marie Montoya Fiore. Yeah. Still too young to be queen, but I guess we have to assume that her mom is just going to be the actual advisor. Yeah. The adults are going to do the, the real ruling. Oh, yeah. Queen Rosie! Oh, look at that. The entire population showed off. <laughs> <laughs> And yep, we've got to round out with one more song that explains what's going on. Honestly, kind of looks like there's just a bunch of random people who aren't even part of their court. Yeah. It's like the whole country turned up and then they had to like fly in some more people. Yeah, yeah. The crowd. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> just not that many people on this <laughs> island. It's really small. Are you ready for your next assignment? I am. Oh, me too. What, now they're joining the program? Yes. Yeah. Cool. So they're secret agents now. Man, how old are they? Because this was one year later. Yeah. They're like 17. Can we go somewhere a little bit warmer? My feet are still frozen. Carter, you can be such a princess. Something wrong with that? No. Oh. Yeah, hilarious. Okay. So what's this assignment? Running on the beach in slow motion. The Baywatch assignment. Yeah. Why is this all in slow-mo? Also though, how can she be a part of the program if she's a queen? She's a ruling monarch of, of her nation? Like, Yeah, did she just like quit being a queen? What? Yeah, well, that was fun to watch at least. <laughs> but I enjoy watching DCOMs as a general rule because yeah. they're ridiculous and look, they're always going to be wildly out of touch. Oh, yeah. In some way or shape or form. And that's part of the fun. And that is part of the fun. Mm. But this one took even more liberties than your usual decom. This yeah. one stretched the truth even harder than you would usually. And I'm like, a movie's job is to make you believe that this world works. Yeah. And I don't. To even just to make you want to suspend yeah. your disbelief to enough you... to allow it to work, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is entering Radio Rebel territories of stupid bullshit, <laughs> you know? I think this is worse. Yeah? I think this is worse. Oh, damn. I think Radio Rebel made more sense than this. Really? Yeah. Damn, okay, fair enough. I mean, it's Radio Rebel stupid. Mm, fair. All DCOMs have some ridiculous shit, but like, I feel like even like Camp Rock and Lemonade Mouth, yeah, that yeah. kind of thing, High School Musical mostly mm. made sense. Yes. They made sense enough in the ways that were important, yeah. you know? Yeah. The ways that they needed to make, make sense. This yeah. shit was literally just <laughs> like, no, we didn't want to think this through. We just wanted it to happen. Hopefully the next decom we get to is going to be a bit more fun. Yeah. I feel like it will. We're, mm. we're looking at either Teen Beach Movie or uh, Let It Shine. Mm -hmm. However, we're not saying that's going to be next. Yeah. It's just the next time we do a decom. Yeah. And until the next movie we do, though, you'd be with Sam. Steph, and we're, we're the, the Movie, movie Buds. buds.